Hello and welcome back to another episode of Long War of the Chosen. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing our Long War uh, Legendary Iron Man playthrough. It's time for Operation Moon Tomb, which is yet another trolling of uh, Bradford. We're fighting against 10 to 12, so assume 12, which is 4 packs, or 5 if they come in 2s. Um, and we need to recover an item. Intel is good because we can expand further. And we got a couple of nice side trips here. Advent forces have stockpiled extra material and storage chests near the site, so we definitely want to have that. It's always good to look out for those extra side trips if uh, you can. Shinobi, Sniper, Grenadier, Ranger, and um, Leo, Cannon Oiler will help us. And uh, that will be pretty much it. Let's uh, launch and go in. All right, I'll land it. Let's take a look. Eight turns. That's a pretty significant distance. Let's scout out first and foremost. Does that trigger? No. Okay. Which means we can push forward. I want to get that tower. Oh, 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 ho, 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 ho. wait a second. We'll do. Head into that location. Ho, 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 wait for a second. Yeah, I think we can start this turn. All right, I'll go. Might sound a bit strange to lose concealment like that. No. Okay, well, of course. It's never that easy. There is a reason for doing that. Whoa, ooh, another drone. Okay, well. Oh, wow. Okay, we did not trigger the other drone. That's helpful. The reason for doing that is we can, if we hit the middle section here, That should be an insta-kill. Yep. Very good. Now, given the situation, which is quite dire. Let's move up to high ground for free. Really grazing shot. You want some more? Okay, we know that there is a drone uh, there. This should not spot us out. These guys are standing very nicely uh, next to an explosive um, object, so I would love to get them. But I think what we're going to do instead is just overwatching. Reanimation? Yeah, figured as much. No, mind control actually, okay. Good hit. And we're losing, of course, we're losing concealment. Moving 
but that likely will not remove the cover. Okay, fantastic. Now, What's over there? someone is still standing next to an explosive object and we can benefit from that. Do some overwatch here. One down, two down. Okay, both of them are down. Might as well hurt him. He is currently disoriented, so can't really move that far and can't use his psi abilities. Likely he's going to take a shot. Shocker. Finally. Moving up, we're running out of time. I hope it's worth it. Move up into a flanking position. Suppressor, fantastic loot. Russ takes high ground. Still wondering where those crates are that they had spoken about. Um, move up. Get the evac out. Okay, we're a bit too slow. We need to speed up. Not drastically, but now ah, well, maybe maybe we need to speed up drastically. Tired of waiting around. Admin troops here. <laughs> All right. Understood. Moving out. That will not remove cover, unfortunately. But it will get them down far enough. Uh, let's just double check what boom can, can we reach. That's one, that's two. Not generally bad. And what are our chances here? 50 50. That guy definitely would die. Let's use that 50 50. Sheesh. Not even close. That was indeed not even close. Could be a kill. Yeah, let's try to get one down for sure.
Alright. We will take damage. Likely. Very likely. Fortunately, you don't have suppression. Good chance, but would not kill him. This is a chance of killing him, but the hit chance is too low, so I'm just going to overwatch. There is another pack here, which is why he's fleeing. No need to be happy about that. Well, partially, I guess we could be happy about that, but not. I guess the point that I'm trying to make is there is no need to enthusiastically cheer. Because now we do have a bigger pack ahead of us. Don't even have ammunition. Running out of time. Alright, we're just overwatching. Getting a little bit closer so that the squad side penalty isn't that drastic. Almost out of time, which is why I am pushing like a madman. Good. We would have the target inside, but we need to get out afterwards. We have one grenade. I don't think that it'll give us a better. Nah, I'll just rather keep it in long war. We're green to go. All of uh, the objects are like super, super, super beefy. See, that's other pack that I was talking about. Menace one five, you're almost out of time. The detonator is about to blow. Finally. Objective sighted. I'm not supposed to shoot this thing. I like the supplies, we need a lot of them. Alright, not happening. We're in. But there is the da data that we needed. Status confirmed. The charges are inactive and the package is secure. Eliminate any remaining hostiles near the AO. Moving out. Move up. See a couple of them. Throwing grenade. Hit a couple of them. Thankfully we saved the grenade. This one here is really in the way. Can't st uh, step in the open either. I'm going. So we're just going to overwatch here. Gunner goes down. And we are 
going to mark the engineer. That gives us 100% hit chance. And with that, a kill. But we need to get out of here. It is definitely no longer safe. Oh, there is the crate. There is the crate. I just saw it. There is the crate. At least we know where they are. Oh, come on, please. Help, help, it it's just panic. That's not the end. Time to go. Time to execute a few of these guys. Nice. Okay, we can kill this guy. That's good. Next up. Overwatch removed. I would like to get that. Moves over. And kill the sector. Stupid little sector. Got a nice little alarm core out of it. Panic removed. Greedy are we? Go, go, go. I hope it's worth it. Okay. That is fabulous. What are we getting? Eleven supplies. That is well worth it. Thing. Okay. Need to get back to here. I hope it's worth it. Still nothing. Damn it. What's over there? Is there another chest? can move out in just one turn On the move. next turn uh, more reinforcements are going to come in <clears throat> but I think we're good I think we can leave before anyone else appears So we got one more turn. I am just double checking if there is no further crate here. Hmm, maybe they only give us one crate per mission. It's stingy if you ask me. Turn. 
And we don't want to fight more reinforcements. We're out of here. Cool. Good mission. Take a big zip out of a good tea mug after a successful mission. Well done, boys. We'll get a second one very soon. Oila is now a sniper. I think that's appropriate. I like it. For Sonar, um, we can now either take more grenades. We can go with center mass or we go with protector. I really like uh, the protector route as well, by the way. Uh, specifically, rapid deployment gives you great uh, utilization for reaction economy. And I also like the fire support, like center mass and formidable isn't bad. But for now, he's going to be cover removal since uh, the prime team, the gray knights, are allowed to pick multiples. Um, I am not too fuzzy about uh, not um, not uh, having enough uh, or choosing one or the other. He does have Ever Vigilant, which is great. Untouchable, which is good. A rapid fire, he will be a great, uh, fantastic fire support. Do we need more grenades for now? I think, I mean, we ran out of grenades and it's never wrong to have an extra grenade, so... Let's do that and we're just fully focusing on him. As for our Shinobi, we can either uh, no longer trigger Overwatch and Reaction Shot Fire, which is great. The Executioner is good as well, uh, extra aim and critical strike. And then Combative, Parry, Melee Attack and Counter Attack, uh, which is absolutely fantastic. Uh, these two are very strong contenders, uh, so not triggering and parrying both is nice my main problem is currently we don't have a lot of options um, to not trigger overwatch uh, to begin with we only have the ranger and suppression so this here could be a way of getting uh, through it center mass uh, death from above oh that's good with his primary weapon Enemy at lower with your SMG refunds a single action. It does not end your turn. Yeah, I mean, look, with uh, center mass, this here becomes a real treat run and gun on top of it. And that level, so plus rapid fire. I can see this uh, to be actually a shooting shinobi. Uh, execution on top of it would absolutely be fantastic uh, with death from above but uh, since Johnny Five is in the prime team there is no need to choose one or the other uh, this is going to be just as good uh, and for now I already am very aware of the mutants that are going to come and mutants are really really bad so damn good ground 10 aim uh, if you're on high ground, which we are a lot. Phantom if you are more of a support type or extra damage with our gun. We need to hit in order to actually kill enemies and we are still not at that point where we reliably hit. So we're going to take them good ground, but center mass is very, very good. Lone Wolf on top of it is fantastic. And let's take a look here. Not that good for him. Rapid deployment can be helpful because uh, sometimes I'm just putting smoke grenades on them, so that could be helpful. Reduces aim penalty uh, for shooting short range, uh, range marksman rifle shots. That isn't bad, uh, but we're not that close. Your ranged attacks gain 15 bonus aim against enemies that are flanked, so that is good. 
Execution is fantastic for a sniper. And level it. So the last three make up for a mediocre first spec, but these three, very good. Together with uh, Serial, Level, Executioner, this guy, once Aras is um, a real grown up, he will be deadly. And we got another death from above for Uncle Nuber <laughs> and another level. Okay, very good. Uh, Dodge is helpful uh, for, uh, for his mid-range. So, we can either get locked on, 20 aim and crit for successive shots, which is helpful. I tend to use uh, that first. Um, the shorty isn't bad either, but we don't have run and gun with him as a special ability. Elsewise, uh, a more shorty oriented build could work. Um, then we got covering fire, which if you go down that route uh, would be helpful, specifically kill zone and um, and uh, covering fire together are great if you then put cool under pressure here and the grazing attacks plus rapid uh, fire, then this guy can just obliterate packs, we just need a superior expanded magazine and go for uh, go for it. Uh, so that could be a great overwatch uh, build, but given that he has death from above level and holo targeting that would be a bit wasted So we're going to take lock on and we're going to go into full action mode, but suppressor good uh, laser sight good And we got 11 supplies, which is fantastic more supplies equals more fun the bond between these soldiers continues to grow can't get uh, level 2 on our bonds yet. We need a... We need a solid uh, engineer. One engineer is a bit low. I'll scan a little bit longer until we're done here and then we rinse and repeat. Operation Pressure Sleep starts liberating the area. Four hours. Um, yeah. No. If we were to go in, that is 40 plus enemies. Uh, no. Good. Well, let's continue to uh, to scan. And um, 12 days. Oh, wow. Hack the advent uh, resistance computer and counter a dark event. Also, extra materials, that is helpful. So new missions can spawn here. The Grey Knights are back and they are ready for some action. Leo can join them. Uh, well, that's a dual sniper. Is uh, that worth it? Do we have anyone else? No. Our Psy operatives and that's about it. Lightly wounded. Well, you know what, Leo? You might join them. Because why not? Going in with dual sniper is a bit... is a bit daring, shall I say, but we're going to go and make it work. Okay, <laughs> what are we going to do? For starters, let me fix that real quick. Okay, I think we can give it a go. Not much, just a couple of weapon uh, upgrades uh, that I needed to put on. We still can't do personal combat sims yet. And uh, this is going to be fun. Uh, because we can very, very fast uh, um, uh, infiltrate this, found the mission ultra early, and we're going to get some nice little loot out of it. So let's start the infiltration with the Grey Knights and get it going.
Good, we could now start uh, the recovery. 22 hours here. That's three days. And it's a good mission, which means I would want to try to get in there. So let's quickly do this mission, then fly over and uh, hope we can field another team there. All right, we need to get to over here, get all three and then get back. That's going to be interesting. I'll be a bit daring and push immediately for the rooftop. Okay, that daring um, turned out to be a good idea. Already there. Moving. Like the public bravo, hooks up. Rolling out. And everybody else is moving as well. Let's just hope we're not getting ambushed. This is a greedy first start. But we're still concealed. Let me check if we find something over here. The answer is no. There's a turret that is... That likely can be hacked. Okay, two double moves and we are very close to the target. Uh, that is here, down here, uh, the sound indicator. Oh, stun lancer. Moves down because we need to throw a grenade soon. Okay, we're in position. Um, getting as close as possible. Overwatch. We are already going to give an aid protocol. This does not reveal. And other, oh, wait, what is reflexes is better dodge chance, hypnography, I think was reduction of will. Let's just check what our chances are before we're doing anything. Yeah, hypnography is bad and dodge chance, yep, yeah, is indicated. Come on, you bucket of bones. Good, we're overwatching. So we have two overwatches and that should be good enough to get this pack big fat hit I don't want to trigger anything, so we're keeping it cool, calm, collected. Renmin is the slowest uh, one of all of them, so might as well just move forward and overwatch. And now the concealment is gone. From now on, uh, this is going to be the real deal, as they say. Combat awareness, not bad. Deploying their so called priests into combat. Their implants provide significant enhancements to whatever latent psionic energy they may have once possessed. Okay, I'll go. Moves up. Target locked. 
Good hit. Overall, good hit. like half cover so let's move fog bite into full cover and we're overwatching here and here and here in case stun lances move in it's likely going to be a mind control no stasis okay whatever stun lances are the real problem This guy just killed himself. No, uh, why? Why is there no Overwatch? Ah, okay. Yeah, there was an Overwatch. Good. That's what I thought would happen. Everything else would have surprised me quite a bit. Trying to just get some cover away from uh, off of him, but yeah, it's barely shattered. Thirty percent, not great. I'm trusting you here. Renvin moves up. Soon reinforcements are going to come in. We'll take one thirty percent shot. Nope. And this is an overwatch just in case he moves forward and suppression should prevent him from using his mind control. Good, moving up. They do have 100% sustenance. However, if you overkill them, uh, the chance of sustenance reduces. So we need to get in here. Reinforcements are soon going to come in. Just want to make sure that we're not Standing right next to him. Instead, what we're going to do is we're going to flank him with Overwatch. Copy that. Back in. We need to move further. Can't stay here. Good, we got Overwatch, 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 that's enough. Uh, if he moves, he should be dead. Okay, we're very soon going to move in. Double checking that nothing triggers. Okay, doesn't. Which tells me we're ready to pick up items and actually get in. Well do. 
60 turns. I'm more concerned about the reinforcements that are going to come in at some point. Opens the door. Nothing. Does that trigger? Still nothing. We can theoretically go through here. I guess that'll be okay. That's not bad, thanks to the rocket opening it. Reinforcements yep, are coming next round. Solid copy. Let's get the best chance to hack. Back online. Small intel cache is exactly what I want. That's good. Hmm. 50-50 to get more intel. Now let's... Hmm. That's 30 intel. Now we're going to take that. Okay, never mind. Completely botched it. Okay, moves to here. Drinks moves to there. Gunner moves to here. Hawkbite moves to here. Maintaining this area. Scanning. Scanning. Two stun lancers. Ah, no, a stun lancer and a sentry. Let's hope we're not triggering them. A stun lancer is a nasty bloodhound who would track us down. I think there were still a few more supplies somewhere, but you know, it's okay. Rather not get injured and get more experience. Ranman, what do you have? Oh, damn good ground, hard to target, low infiltration. Evasive is great. Hmm. You know what? We wanted different builds, right? So let's do an Overwatch build. Reduce wound time, of course. This one isn't bad either, it does the end the turn. Free action. Mm -hmm. Hard to debate about uh, that. Wound reduction time, however, is great as well, but I think we're going to go with interference because we don't. And uh, Mike is on the prime team on, uh, on the Grey Knights, so uh, he can 
even take multiples anyway so this here is good uh, but we need more methods to deal with overwatch which is currently something that we cannot do all right elliot shadow step ahead untouchable uh did have <laughs> which is funny right so if you did not move you gain more aim and um, this here literally is move and kill someone with your blade. But it looks like a very stationary build. This here is great for survivability. Uh, we could go for the classical uh, Overwatch uh, build, but I think given his excellent skills, we might really want to go with the uh, with the normal damage build. Flush isn't good though, I don't like it. Formidable is actually good because you can be a frontliner. And then we're going to take all of those. Uh, Sane is not in the prime team, which means he cannot pick multiples. Comet Awareness, something for an Overwatch build, and Auto Loader. Yeah, I think we should check for new recruits. Problem is, I also need other stuff to be done. But, you're right. Instead of hiding, you guys will start to recruit. And recruitment, um, Doreen can help you with that. Until, of course, we're in the next... Oh, I forgot I wanted to do the other mission. Mm. Okay, now we... S let's... That's going to be a problem. Anyways, this is going to happen the next time. We're very, very uh, infiltrated here. Something is in, in the air and our squad is definitely ready to do that. But we're going to do that the next time. Thanks for watching, guys. If you appreciate uh, the content, leave a comment uh, and a like down below. And see you, there. see you in the next run. Bye-bye.